And chamomile is one of the most ancient medicinal herbs known to mankind. But very few farmers in Kenya have ventured into this type of farming, despite the crop's potential to fetch more money when compared to traditional crops. Now, some farmers in Meru County have, however, taken up the challenge and are warming up to chamomile farming. Dennis Otieno has more on this week's Smart Farm. <laughs> A sweet cocktail of scents greets you at Moses Mwiti's farm, located at Matunda village at Kisima Ward in Meru County. The white-flowered shrubs of chamomile are visible in this farm. Mwiti, a former police officer in the General Service Unit, has ventured into chamomile farming. He delved into it after thorough research, largely from the online platforms. <laughs> The chamomile is represented by two common varieties, namely German chamomile and Roman chamomile. The dried flowers of chamomile contain substances such as tapanoids and flavonoids, contributing to its medicinal properties. Mwiti grows his chamomile organically. The crop is drought tolerant and can perform well in semi-arid areas. Based on his experience so far, Mwiti describes chamomile farming as easy as it requires less labor. Chamomile takes roughly two months to grow from seed to harvest. A kilogram of dried chamomile flowers fetches a thousand shillings. Uh, within two days. The lack of knowledge, however, on where to sell the hub and low consumption of Kenyans, especially in rural areas, means that few farmers are aware of its potential. It is against this backdrop that Mwiti is now using his farm as a demonstration center to woo more farmers into chamomile farming. <laughs> Dennis Otieno, Smart Farm.